Hi guys, Blanche here, just sitting here eating oatmeal in my uh, favorite, our Christmas cup. But um, yeah, I'm about to go in the garage and see what I do with the Macy. Hopefully that starter is still good. It's just a, a bad ground or something. I'm worried that I uh, fried it with the uh, fried it with the jump package. That's supposed to use a jump pack directly to the starter and the wiring. Um, and plus there was something spark in there in um, the video, so I could have something to do with it. Um, I was scouring eBay and stuff and um, looking for a vintage Tecumseh starter because I'd rather have like uh, an original Tecumseh starter on there, one that works really good. And uh, even if the aftermarket one does work pretty good, but so I just rather have something vintage. There's a, there's a guy like an hour or something went from me that has one and, um, on Craigslist and I just uh, um, don't know if he would ship it or something because I, I doubt he would like deliver it in his car. My poor mom won't. Want to drive there just to get a starter, but um, I don't know. I'll figure something out. Uh, yeah, I would love to have a vintage starter on my uh, Tecumseh engine. I may just have to, uh, if the wiring becomes too much of a burden for me, I may just get a, a Polestar uh, Briggs or uh, Tecumseh Snow King engine for the Macy. Just do away with the wiring, or maybe a Harbor Freight engine. I don't know. But let's get to the garage. I gotta finish up my oatmeal, guys. Hi guys, Bleach here. How's it going? Back in the uh, rainy, leaky garage. Um, I figured out what my problem was. I took the cover off. It was like uh, the starter was engaging and um, was sparking against the cover, of course. But what the problem was is whatever the, you can see it, whatever the, the hell that thing is, that strip there, you can't really see. And that oil thing spout, drain spout, that was grounded against the frame. And it was not making the starter work. And so it was a bad ground on the frame. Go figure. But let's see. Alright. We got a push button switch wired. I uh, wired in a, a tube fuse. And uh, just a ground wire. But I got to figure out how this thing charges. And I'll have to... Uh, drill out this hole right there to make it thick as the key switch is smaller than the uh, push button switch and of course I lost the nut that goes on there <laughs> hopefully I still got it somewhere I got other ones but I guess it works now I just wanted to tell you that guys but I will be going live tonight for Toonami uh, the anime show that people watch and so I don't show like a split screen my reaction to when I just run my mouth. But yeah guys, at least it's something. And um, I really wish, I don't know if you can see that uh, Tecumseh cover over there. I really wish I can put that Tecumseh cover on here and make it a pull start. But I don't know how to do that. But I'm going to let you guys go. And please comment and subscribe. And maybe Godzilla will pay a, a visit to my garage soon just for uh, Gypsy Brand. Uh, tuber there i'm not even sure what that noise was but it sure was scary i heard it in the video too gypsy but uh take care guys bye